This one is called Groovy Rainbow. For pretty obvious reasons. Hey, how's it going? Behind me is a project I've been working on and I would like to share it with you. The goal of this project has been to create a virtual environment that's easily modified. Right now that project consists of a desk and the LED strip lights that are attached to that desk. It also consists of LED strip lights that are connected to the trim. It also consists of those two lights and their controllers being connected to a automated smart home system so that it can be automated as well as easily controlled. Um, right now I'm going to be showing you what these lights can do and how they can change this entire environment as a workspace or as a relaxing space or any space inside of your home. So let's get going. I'm going to show you a little bit of what these things can do. I either took too much acid or I played way too much rainbow level Mario Kart. Which one do you think it was? <laughs> I'm going to be making more videos soon. So if you're interested, please subscribe. I'll show you how I put things together and any other interesting ideas that I've come up with that I think are interesting. And hopefully you got a little bit inspired by some of the stuff that I've done here. So hopefully you want to see a little bit more and I'll put more stuff out there. Thanks for watching. I really appreciate it and uh, hope you watch the next one. Thanks. This is Groovy Rainbow. Notice the light at the top changing colors along with the rainbow theme. Look at all those beautiful colors. This lighting system was designed to not have any direct lighting being created by the LED lights. Uh, this way it fills the room with ambient lighting and you don't get the harsh effect from the LEDs being directly shined in your eyes. This one's theme is Make It Rain. Notice the nice calm feeling of a nice soft drizzle. The trim at the top is designed specifically for this project. Um, I prototyped a clip that attaches the trim in a floating manner away from the wall. That way you can have the lighting going below and above it. This one's theme is Passion Fire, my wife's personal favorite. All of these LED light strips have proper power injection. Uh, there's actually power injection cables running through the center of the trim across the ceiling. Uh, this allows for maximum brightness for each individually addressable LED. This is my personal favorite. This is the forest theme. I just love the relaxing greens of the forest. So uh, I thought I'd elaborate a little bit more about uh, what I've been working on here. Um, this is basically one big experiment. Uh, I had this idea a long time ago about uh, efficiency of basically the use of your time. So we all spend time relaxing, we all spend time doing our normal jobs or job. And then we all spend some of our free time being productive and some of our free time having fun, some of our free time with friends and family. Uh, for me, <clears throat> I found that like personal time, basically pursuing hobbies that uh, I enjoyed was always limited because I felt like I didn't have a good workspace. So the 
project began as being a workspace exercise where I hand built this entire desk in about uh, it was probably about four months uh, in total wood and supplies and tool costs. It was somewhere in the neighborhood of I think it ended up coming out to eleven hundred. I spent close to three hundred dollars every month for four months. Uh, just basically purchasing supplies as I needed them. And I think it came out pretty cool. Um, it's actually a modular desk. So all of these are separate units that uh, I built. Um, and each one serves its own purpose, but they also build as, they act as supports for the cabinets that are above. Um, basically built for efficiency and storage so that I could work on any project that I wanted to. And the first project that I wanted to work on was uh, LED lighting. Specifically, these uh, are individually addressable LED light strips. And I basically just bought a few different controllers for as cheap as possible and then started fiddling with them and came up with the idea of using them to light an entire room, not only the desk because uh, I originally just did the desk as a way of making the desk cooler and also as an experiment again to see how lighting affects your work efficiency as well as your relaxed time. Uh, the cool thing about this desk is that uh, I can get off work and then just come in here and uh, I get off work late so uh, when I get here I can just have a seat in here and then uh, just enjoy the mood setting lighting and relax and it makes it so that I can start being productive within a short period of time which uh, you know I feel like it makes me not only more productive but uh, also makes me happier and sees things from a more positive point of view uh, something about uh, being able to just be creative and you know, make something that I always wanted to make. I always wanted to have a cool desk that uh, I can pursue some cool hobbies and have some fun. Uh, that's what this whole project has basically been about. I've always been an artist. Uh, never very good one, apparently. I worked in video games for about three or four years, starting when I was 21 until I was 24 and some change. Uh, and then I've been working in the hospitality customer service business ever since and always been pursuing hobbies. Uh, I attended art school, the Academy of Art of San Francisco. Uh, you know, and my study of art has made me a little bit more creative, I think. Uh, and through that creativity, this is what I decided to pursue. And uh, I've really enjoyed the journey and I just wanted to share it with some people. Um, kind of the whole point of this entire video is sharing, and I hope people like it. I uh, put a lot into this thing, and uh, if anyone wants to know how I did it, uh, just ask, make some comments, and I'll uh, make some videos and show you how I did anything in here, uh, from lights to circuitry to power injection to how I built the desk and how I did all of that. Um, <clears throat> basically like a really, really functional, but really clean aesthetic and uh, the labor of love to create. And I just wanted to share that with you. I'm gonna be putting together some guide videos soon. I'm basically just gonna do a step-by-step -step of how I put this together. And I'm planning on putting this in the entire house. So every time I do a new room and a new install, I will do a video showing how I did it step-by-step. Everything you have to buy, everything you have to basically just set up. Um, once you get through it, it's actually pretty quick. Um, and I'll show you how to do it uh, as I do the entire rest of the house, hopefully, with that. That way I can do an entire house worth of a massive light show. Uh, in this room alone, there are 1,877 individually addressable LED lights. By the time I get done with the rest of the house, I'm hoping to definitely crack 10K and then have all those controllers connected to one system so I can make the entire house do this <laughs> in every single room. 
Uh, so if you want to see that and you want to learn how to do it and maybe have something like that in your favorite room or in your entire house too, uh, I can show you how I did it so then you can do it. All right. Uh, thanks for watching.